Hey, welcome to Friendship Shaving. Mark here, and I'm midway through my shave, and the video that I was making has just gone wrong. So we'll just do a quick one, I'm on my final pass, but I've got a soap that I really, really wanted to share with you. And uh, that was the purpose of the video tonight. So I've been using an OSP soap, which is made in London. It's the Obsessive Soap Perfectionist. And uh, this is their barbershop scented soap. And it is fantastic. You can see from the pot that it's a really large pack of soap. It's 140 grams. It's full of good stuff. The ingredients are all natural, organic or unrefined. If I open it up and hold it in the light, you can see that the soap goes right up to there. So that really is, what's that, a couple of centimetres. That is a big puck of soap. Uh, it's quite a hard soap. It lathers up beautifully. Unfortunately, as I said, the video has gone wrong, so I can't show you that bit. Uh, but I didn't want to leave it another day. I wanted to get this video out. Now, this soap is amazing. I've been using it for a few days. And the first thing that grabs you is a smell of bergamot. There's some lavender hidden, hidden behind that bergamot. There's some patchouli, some cedarwood and a touch of basil. And um, oh, let me tell you, that smell is just wonderful. And after you've shaved, it stays on your skin for quite a long time. So I've just been just been wallowing in this lovely smell. So they never use fragrance oils at OSP. It's all good stuff. I've never had a tub of this before. As I said, it was a present. So I can't tell you what the price is. But just to say that I'm loving this. And their website is ospsoap.com. Now, I can't recommend this enough. It's a tallow soap. Now I like tallow soaps, I know there are lots of vegetarian alternatives. Uh, but just to tell you in this there is some kaolin, which is china clay, and apparently that helps with uh, the slick on the skin, so you get a nice easy glide with the razor, and it certainly, certainly works. Now I've never had a, I've never had a soap with kaolin in before, but it's terrific. There is, uh, as I said, it's a tallow soap. For those that don't know, tallow is rendered beef fat, usually beef fat is rendered down to uh, suet and then further rendered into tallow. There is um, castor oil, glycerin, again that will help with the slick. Um, cocoa oil, there's a little bit of menthol, avocado oil, uh, there's just loads of good stuff in this. So, as I say, unfortunately, I'm on my third pass, so I can't show you as much as I would have liked, but we'll just continue. What's amazing is the smell as you're using this, it's absolutely phenomenal. I am absolutely loving this. My sister did a good job this Christmas. Thank you, Penny. You know, we're so lucky, aren't we? We've got all these shaving products that we can use. And you can never use all of them in your lifetime. We're so spoilt for choice. It's wonderful. It's my birthday coming up soon and I've ordered myself a new brush. I ordered a V-Long horsehair brush. Now I've never shaved with a horsehair brush but they are quite popular and V-Long are very renowned. So I'm expecting that in the post 
as my little treat to myself for my 54th birthday, which will be on January the 28th. Loads of lather from this soap, loads. Tonight I've been using my Fat Boy with a Gillette 7 o'clock uh, sharp blade, sharp edge blade, sorry. Um, they work really well in the Fat Boy. Whether it's because it's a, a mild razor and they're a sharp blade, but it's a really good combination. Now let me just say that the glide from this soap is terrific. This is definitely my new favourite. So I've just been wondering that if there's anything you'd like me to talk about in these videos or anything you should say or anything you think I should say or mention, please leave a comment. I'd love to know what your thoughts are. And similarly, as I obviously love this product, if you've got any products that you, you know, love and rave about, then uh, please just let me know. Don't keep them to yourselves. You know, I've had a brilliant shave tonight, absolutely brilliant. I've hit a great combination here. Very good indeed. Now I'll just rinse my face with some clean water. I'll come right back to you. I smell fantastic. <laughs> this is great soap. Let me just show you again. The Obsessive Soap Perfectionist. I want to have a look and see what other fragrances they do. Because this, this, I love this one. So tonight I'm just going to use, because I want to keep that smell on my skin. I don't want to put an aftershave on that's going to cover that up. So I'm just going to pop on some Nivea for Men Sensitive. And we're just going to rub that in. And I know that smell will stay with me now for a good few hours. This is a great soap, so just to remind you, I'm sorry it's a short video, my mate rang me up on uh, FaceTime through my iPad and it stopped the recording straight away, even though I didn't take the call. Um, so there we go. So the Obsessive Soap Perfectionist Barbershop Scented Soap, a huge puck, absolutely brilliant, I love it. And uh, of course, 
The Friendship Shave tonight was also brought to you by the ever-reliable Fat Boy with the Gillette 7 o'clock yellows. And that's, that's a great combination. I really think I've hit to something there. Do more on that another time. So that's me. Sorry it's a short one, but take care of yourselves and uh, I hope you've had I hope you've had a good weekend and some good shapes. All the best.